Unit 4. Let's talk. In this lesson, we learn how to talk in different situations. First, we'll talk about an interview. What is an interview? It is a formal meeting of people in face-to-face -to, -face to obtain information. What are different situations where interviews are held? In school, for example, selecting prefects. You can add another two. When we take outside the school, for an example, a woman is interviewed for a job. A musician is interviewed in a radio station. Athletes are interviewed after a race. Now you have to complete this in your writing book. Now take out your textbooks and turn to page 34. Activity 1. Talk to your friends and find these. Find someone who. Kaud. Number 2. Find Someone who's called. Talk to your friends and find this information. Then complete it in your writing books. I'll give you an example. Someone who Nipun collects foreign stamps as a hobby. Someone who's Kasun's best friend's name begins with U. Ruan's favorite game is volleyball. Activity 2. It is a listening activity. Shakti is a boy of your age. He is interviewed to test his English language proficiency. Listen to the dialogue and fill in the data sheet given in the activity 2 in unit 4 in your workbook. Now, before that, you first read the data sheet and find the meanings of the words. Then, please listen to the following recording. Good morning, sir. May I come in? Uh, good morning. Please sit down. Uh, how are you? I am fine. Thank you, sir. Uh, tell me your name with initials, please. And uh, your first name? I am empty in spirits. I have two first names. Nirindu, Shakti. I prefer Shakti. Shakti. Uh, tell me about your best friend. My best friend is Chamudit. We are in the same class. He is dark but pleasant. He is kind and very helpful. Okay, Shakti. Tell me the things you do in your leisure time. My hobby is reading books. I prefer to read novels on adventure. Uh, name a recently read novel. Madaldu by Martin Wickramasinghe. Can you please tell me the story in brief? In four five sentences? The main character of the story is Upali. Jinnah is his friend. One day, they ran away from home. After facing many challenges, finally, they could cultivate the small island called Madoldu. Why do you prefer reading adventures? Because my aspiration is to be a journalist. For that, I need a rich set of vocabulary. Reading adventures makes my thinking positive and I think I'm, I like the excitement prevails throughout the adventures. Shakti, now study this picture for 30 seconds and talk about it. Uh, you will get two minutes to talk about it. Right. You will hear the dialogue again and tick the words you hear in the dialogue. The words are given below.
Good morning, sir. May I come in? Uh, good morning. Please sit down. Uh, how are you? I am fine. Thank you, sir. Uh, tell me your name with initials, please. And uh, your first name? I am empty in spirits. I have two first names. Nirindu, Shakti. I prefer Shakti. Shakti. Uh, tell me about your best friend. My best friend is Chamudit. We are in the same class. He is dark but pleasant. He is kind and very helpful. Okay, Shakti. Tell me the things you do in your leisure time. My hobby is reading books. I prefer to read novels on adventures. Uh, name a recently read novel. Madaldu by Martin Wickramasinghe. Can you please tell me the story in brief? In four or five sentences? The main character of the story is Upali. Jinnah is his friend. One day, they ran away from home. After facing many challenges, finally, they could cultivate the small island called Madoldur. Why do you prefer reading adventures? Because my aspiration is to be a journalist. For that, I need a rich set of vocabulary. Reading adventures makes my thinking positive. And I think I'm, I like the excitement prevails throughout the adventures. Shakti, now study this picture for 30 seconds and talk about it. Uh, you will get two minutes to talk about it. Activity 3 In the dialogue, you heard the examiner ask different kinds of questions to test Shakti's language proficiency. List out the question words you heard in the dialogue. Then, Write two questions using each of those question words in your writing.